But at this time, I want to introduce you Dr. Alvin Kadieski, who is the president of us, Geoscience and Remote Sensing Society. And he will, Dr. Kadieski. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Tonight is a very auspicious one because although not all of us might not feel like it, we are 25 years old. <laughs> and tonight, we celebrate nothing less than the birth of modern remote sensing of the Earth. Just like any 25-year-old, we've lived through various stages having begun our existence during the infancy of satellites and subsequently surviving in adolescence characterized by experimentation, development, and growth, we are now mature, capable, and ready to serve the global society within which we live. Before we indulge in fine dining, I'd like to acknowledge the generous support for our banquet from the Ball Aerospace and Technology Corporation who will be presenting a very exciting video on the Deep Impact Project later this evening. Okay. I'd also like to acknowledge the presence of several special guests, including Cleon Anderson, President and Chief Executive Officer of the IEEE. Dr. Jungwook Seo, former IEEE Region 10 Director, Fellow of the IEEE, and former Minister of Science and Technology in Korea. <laughs> and Dr. Kyunmo Chung, President of the Korean Academy of Science and Technology. I'd like to uh, invite uh, Dr. Chung to the podium if he wishes to say a few words. Distinguished guests and uh, honored participants, ladies and gentlemen, it is indeed my great pleasure and privilege to welcome and congratulate the 25th Inter International Geoscience and Remote Sensing Symposium of IEEE on behalf of the Korean Academy of Science and Technology. The theme of this symposium, Harmony Between Man and Nature, is most timely in view of the promulgation of the Kyoto Protocol on Climate Change, which became effective in February this year. The issues of global warming and climate change due to increasing emission and the accumulation of greenhouse gases are indeed drawing our attention and the call for our decisive actions for the international community. My secretary told me I should speak about 15 minutes, but I'm not going to do <laughs> in view of uh, this uh, distinguished gathering. But I would like to say that the science of geoscience and the te technology of remote sensing really helped us, the mankind, over the years in resolving energy issues and also helping to prevent number of environmental issues, including water, air, and the soil. I think in the coming years, your role and the yours, science and technology will really be needed because we are in the we are experiencing once again energy crisis and environmental problems are getting very serious. I'm so happy to see this gathering in our country, particularly in the city of Seoul. I hope you will enjoy 
the dynamism of our country, and also, I hope you will enjoy the Korean hospitality during your stay here. I'd like to congratulate once again the 25th anniversary of this uh, distinguished meeting. And uh, I'd like to add my thanks to President Anderson and uh, Professor Moon and the other organizers and the local host of this conference. I really hope you enjoy uh, the rest of your program and uh, bring back wonderful memories and uh, fond stories of this conference to your native countries. Thank you very much. Thank you. 